to see how this looks when it's all said and done. I don't know if you can hear my 80s metal white snake cracking me up. Anyway, uh, just sitting here, kind of chatting back and forth with uh, with one of my buddies about about the new president and all that kind of stuff. And I don't know. He said something about a quick fix. I don't think there is a, a quick a quick fix. It, it didn't it didn't break quickly. This has been coming for a long time. Uh, one of the things that that geez, when my ex-wife and I first first uh, bought our first house, the banks wanted us to, to lend us way more money than we could could pay back. And uh, you know, we were smart enough to know we can't pay this money back. Uh, and the same thing happened when we bought this house. The banks were encouraging us to borrow as much money as possible, even though we had already done the math. We knew what we could afford and, and you know, how much we needed to save and, and all that kind of stuff. But not everybody, I can see where it would be real easy to, to say, you're the banker. That's why we're here. You you tell us how much money. You know, the real estate lady said we had to come and see you first. Uh, so I can see, but that's been going on for years and years. And now here it is. Uh, all all that bad debt. It's all that bad debt. All those people that bought those properties that that uh, they really couldn't afford in the first place if they'd just done their math themselves. Uh, so you can blame the banks, but they were being encouraged by, actually by the government. So, I, I, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, uh, just felt like I needed to get that off my chest. So, hope hope you all uh, can see me, because that's different than this. I'll talk to you later.